Ja. 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 Sjur Brodig and Martin Sufi. Um, first of all, to start with the, the bronze medalist Brodig. You um, had a great season so far. Uh, you won in Canmore in the World Cup. And uh, so great results before Christmas. You didn't compete in Tour de Ski. And now, you you want this bronze medal in a world championship well first of all how do you feel yeah it was uh, it was a really uh, great race for me today i'm um, really satisfied uh, and uh, i've been uh, oh, i was oh, i was uh, not so nervous in front of this race i was uh, uh, yeah, had a, a, cal a calm uh, morning and uh, everything felt fine. So um, yeah, I'm really, really satisfied. <laughs> you uh, close to the end of this race, you did a great move and you passed uh, the Russian Vidic Janin. Did you expect him not to fight till the very end? Uh, yeah, it was my personal fault that I was uh, behind him. I thought he was uh, supposed to hang on Dario, but uh, he didn't have much power left. So uh, yeah, it's uh, it's my own fault that I wasn't in uh, in uh, the back of Dario. So, uh, but I'm I'm really satisfied with the bronze medal, and uh, it's good to have Martin by my side here. So, so let's go to Martin and. Uh, He's a new father. Congratulations. <laughs> Thank you. Well, mm, did you expect this medal today while, while I mean, the, the first time you left behind everyone in the second part in the uh, free technique? Were you already thinking about the medal at that time? Send it over to Mikke. Uh, actually, I didn't expect to get the gap at all. <laughs> I think uh, the seconds I got on the second uh, lap in the skating was for most uh, because of Schur and uh, Petter who slowed the pace down for uh, the rest of the guys. And uh, suddenly I had a, a few seconds. I tried to um, keep a quite okay speed, but um, I didn't uh, at any point think that uh, this will hold to a gold medal. Um, so for a third uh, lap I tried to calm myself down, uh, rest a bit and wait for the guys and be prepared for a very tough uh, fourth lap. Did you ever talk to each other with Petter as well during the race? Uh, no, there was no talking today. Um, uh, I think uh, all of the Norwegian guys uh, went for medals. Uh, personal medals, so um, I was prepared to fight to the last centimeter uh, today for a medal and uh, that was the, I did that, so I think there was quite a few, a couple of centimeters between me and Sure. Just the last question, do you maybe know about the Mickey Mouse trophy here in Val di Fiemme, about kids who will be bringing your little kid in the future, competing? Uh, yeah, hopefully. Um, <laughs> Uh, I think uh, it will be a few years, but <laughs> maybe, sometimes. Okay, thank you. Uh, any other question in English, please? Yes, uh, sure. Oh. Uh, thank you. Sure, uh, I've never seen anybody skate so beautifully as you do. Your, your technique is more perfect. Are you a natural talent, or did somebody teach you to skate like that? First of all, uh, thank you. I'm uh, I'm glad to hear that. 
my uh, skating is uh, I feel it's yeah, it's really good now. We have uh, strong skaters on the team, and uh, yeah, I think maybe me and especially me and Martin have uh, done a good job in uh, in the skating part of uh, skating technique uh, this year, this summer, and uh, and autumn. So yeah, we've uh, learned a lot of each other, and uh, uh, wanted. Uh, both of us to be to be good skaters, and uh, I think that's uh, maybe the main part. Any other question in English? Okay, thank you very much, guys. Congratulations. Yeah, thank you very much. 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 thank you very much. thank you very much. you can have them all by yourself. <laughs> Romanisch. Yeah, it was a great, great feeling, and uh, I really want to win the, this gold medal. And uh, yes, uh, I did ed everything, and uh, so uh, it was a great feeling. I felt uh, very great uh, the whole race, and uh, yeah, to come uh, alone into the stadium, it's it's uh, always a, a great feeling, uh, and uh, it was was also my plan. Yes. Apart from the fall uh, in the middle today, have you ever feared Norwegians they could come back, especially Petter Nordov? Or you were sure today you were stronger than him? <laughs> yeah, you, know, you never know, but uh, I felt very strong today, and uh, yes, uh, it was a very uh, tactical race, and also. When uh, Sunpi went away, it was the other athletes were very passive, and uh, I, I did a lot uh, of work uh, alone, and so uh, and even more uh, yes uh, happy that I could win at the end, and uh, and I feel yes I felt very strong in the half hills, and uh, I knew that I can win today. In Tudeski, Alexander Lekov beat you. Today, did you expect them uh, a different reaction, a different race, or no? Yeah, I expect uh, a big group. It's not a big. It's not a surprise. It's always uh, the men's competition. It's it's very close until the end. And uh, but uh, yes, maybe I expect that someone uh, will uh, try a little bit early. But I mean. Uh, Yes, you know uh, who is the strongest if it's coming to to a sprint. And uh, but uh, yeah, for, for me it was a, a good race. I tried uh, to attack a little bit earlier today, and uh, then first we go away with a small group. And uh, but I was not 100% and had enough uh, power for the, for the last uphill to go away. And uh, yeah, it feels uh, very good uh, when I look back. And uh, so. Uh, a small uh, gap behind me. 
Any open question in English, please? It, it feels very great. Uh, it's, yeah, it doesn't matter uh, where I win the gold medal, but of course it's <laughs> it's a, it's nice to win here. It's close to my home, and uh, also a lot of uh, uh, friends and uh, family. All the family is here, and so yeah, it feels great. And uh, Valdifiemme was always a good place for me, and uh, after today, it's even even better. Yeah. In, in, in the world. In the world. Well, I think uh, that's. Then I have the wrong sport. Yeah, it's <laughs> <laughs> then I have to start with something else, not uh, with cross country skiing. Yeah. <laughs> you never know. <laughs> and how about your uh, technique against the Norwegian team uh, today? The tactic? Yeah, it was not always the Norwegian, but they had a good uh, tactic. And uh, yeah, when Sunpi go away, I uh, stay just uh, quiet, but uh, nobody want to <laughs> close the gap. And uh, I really want to fight for the gold medal and not for the silver medal. So I decided to close uh, my gap uh, my, by myself. And uh, so in the end, it was uh, the right decision. And uh, yes, everything. Uh, was perfect for me. Thank you. Any other question in yeah. English? What, what was your plan before the race when you were thinking about it? Yeah. Yes, you can always have a plan, but you have to decide then in the race. But uh, I knew, so I thought that it will be very close, and uh, important is sure the the last. Uh, Skating, the skating part, and uh, just want to be in the front, and uh, yes, if possible, to to attack already in the last lap. And yes, I knew also that uh, the last uphill is is uh, interesting for me. I did it already in Sochi, in the last uphill, and uh, and today I did it again, and uh, yeah, so that was my plan. <coughs> What have you been thinking when you fetched down at the beginning of the race? What, what were your thoughts? Yeah, it was very early in the race, so it was not uh, for the race. It was not so very important. Uh, of course, I lost uh, many positions, but uh, it was after uh, two kilometers, and so I just <laughs> stay up. And uh, <laughs> but this, I was uh, in the stadium. I think I was already back uh, in, the, in the top 10 so it was not uh, was not a big problem yeah. one more question and now you you won everything world title the world title uh, world cup the two big series what's the next plane now your fox you know, the biggest uh, challenge for the focus or what next, yeah First, we are still here in Val di Fiemme and uh, some interesting races for me. The next focus is uh, 15 uh, kilometers and uh, I think I have good chances there and also in the 50 Ks. So, uh, yes, uh, the, f the shape is here and uh, I feel good and uh, I try to make uh, some more good races here in Val di Fiemme and then, of course, the next year, uh, Sochi is, uh, is uh, the next big goal for me. Any other question? No? Okay, thank you very much. Sorry for calling you. Thank you. Sorry, congratulations. Great race. Do you think that uh, Peter finally uh, paid for his uh, sort of careless tactics staying in the back when it comes uh, to the closing stages?